What is the Pontifical Mission Society? What is it that we do? It's th to recognize that I am part of a broad worldwide family, a worldwide network of prayer and almsgiving to assist those who are just coming now to know Christ so that their faith might be strong. The Pontifical Mission Societies have the primary role in animating the faithful. We are the Holy Father's mission organization, and we have been gifted with the charism of energizing the faithful to be supportive of the missions, but also to live out their lives as missionary disciples. The Pontifical Mission Societies, it exists in every part of the world, over 120 countries, and we're this international network to connect the church together for the sake of supporting the missions. When our archdiocese was started 200 years ago, we received a lot of help from the propagation of the faith in France, uh, which had recently been started by uh, Paul and Jericho. But so now it's our, our turn <laughs> to help other churches the way that, that we have been helped. It's our turn to help emerging churches in other places on, on the planet. I take a lot of my inspiration from Pauline Jericho. She was a young woman, young lay woman, in the early 1800s, and she founded the Society for the Propagation of the Faith. Here I am, I'm a young lay woman in the church. Our world is in need of Jesus, and that message has not reached all corners of the globe yet. And so mission never goes away. It's easy for us, I think, to uh, focus on uh, the work of the mission in our own areas, whether it be in our families, our parishes, our own diocese or archdiocese. But to having something like World Mission Sunday every year, we're reminded to focus on the work of mission on that more universal, global scale of something that is, is so significant. I'm so grateful that the Pontifical Mission Societies stimulate that every year. I do ask priests on Mission Sunday to preach on the missions. The priests tell us that this is the one collection that we really support. We all have an obligation to fill that, that missionary mandate. Well, the work of the mission still continues. Propagation of faith is still the main support for many of these dioceses. Children helping children is something that we're trying to put into place in each of our schools to bring awareness of their baptismal right of being a missionary at a young age. We try to go out and visit schools. We want them to, to realize how blessed they are and, and then you always have to, again, urge them to take that home. So they are missionaries to their own families. Everyone is a missionary by virtue of baptism, but becoming a missionary is what uh, makes us uh, a true disciple of Christ. Anyone who comes to me asking, how could I get involved in mission? I first tell them, go to your parish. Because every parish has a lot of things, activities and mission going on. A parish is the first mission location for a faithful. We instill a sense of mission in the faithful by proclaiming it with joy. Whether it's through mission appeals, rosary praying, we want to get the stories of the missionaries into the homes of the faithful all around the diocese. The Great Commission, go and baptize all nations. You have an encounter with someone whom you love, and that person is Jesus Christ. You want to share that encounter. For a Christian, when they fall in love with Christ, they want to be able to share that they've fallen in love with Christ with everyone whom they come into contact and meet. Pontifical Mission Society helps us understand our missionary vocation, each and every one of us. That encounter with Christ is going to call us to be at the service of one another.